Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Vinland Saga Season 2 Episode 10. Last episode was absolutely incredible. One of the best episodes of Vinland Saga I've ever seen, probably. Um, it was just amazing seeing Thor's, Askeladd, Bjorn, uh, Thorfinn with this absolute growth coming back from what was basically hell, uh, but figuratively, not actually. Um, and just being like, yeah, you know what? No more violence. I'm a changed man. I like this change for Thorfinn. I want him to grow and not be trapped by his past. Although, like I said in the last episode, I just believe that the world he lives in, sometimes there is necessary violence. But I still think he will change as a person and he will grow. And I love that and I love Einar being there for him. And I just I just want to see this duo grow even more. Um, but yeah, overall, very excited for this episode. So, as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Hey, yo. We're getting big bodied, making big strides. Let's go. Sheesh. My guy is built. That manual labor, that, labor, that hard work. Damn, bro. They're both fucking JoJo characters. Crazy. How much land have we cleared now? How long has it been? The last one? Of this patch of land or are we done? What? Bro, look at this smiling boy. Let's go. Love to see it. Are we really done? Like, there's forest behind there, but I guess... Wow, three years. Oh, more than three years. We've got all those stumps in the ground still, but shit, that must feel good. So how old are they now then, like? I wouldn't even be able to guess. Maybe like 20? 21? Jeez! So what, like a year? That's when the next harvest will be, presumably? Or maybe less? Could just work, keep working here. Yeah, stay here and keep her safe, I guess. Mm, that's why he's not entirely a good man. There isn't anything waiting for him in Iceland, is there? Are the rest of his family still alive? I can't remember. I don't want these guys to split up. I want them to just go traveling or something or own a farm. It must feel so weird must having like a chunk of your ear missing. What do you want to do, Thorfinn? Rid the world of war and slavery. Wow. That's a tall order, bro. That's fucking hype. So I don't know about war, but maybe you can get a get a head start on slavery not being a thing anymore. Yeah? Wow, he's letting them go early. Oh shit. That's fucking cool. They don't even have to wait like till the next harvest. Yatta! <laughs> Oh my god, what if they're like, you have to wait till I return, Kettle goes off somewhere and dies, and then someone else takes over the farm, and they're like, nope, you're staying slaves. Visit King Harold. Oh, okay. So this is before Canute comes into play, then. Olmar looking a little bit older. If it's been three years since the start... Nalmar was like seven, wasn't that all? Wasn't he seventeen at the start? It's an idea. Einar would be suited for it. Thorfinn's got bigger dreams, though. What benefit is there for the work for the worker from that in which he labors? I have seen the task which God has given the sons of mankind. With which the two occupy themselves, he has made everything appropriate in its time. Interesting. There is also eternity in the heart without the possibility that mankind will find out the work which God has done from the beginning even to the end. Kind of epic. Okay. Oh, some real Viking shit. What's going on here? Who's this? 
Oh, your majesty. Oh, it's Canute, is it? We are working on two different timelines here. Oh, look at this boy. I'm confused about the timeline now. Are uh, like two different timelines into are like ongoing here? Like this is the present, I suppose. Or is this back in the past a bit when he was still trying to become one of the kings? No, because he's got his beard, so he must be king now, right? This story got me confused as hell right now. Oh, I forgot. Okay, so Canute's brother is kingdom the king of a different different country because Canute's king of England. Got it. Oh, he was like a good older brother. <laughs> he just fell on his face. He's fine. Must be properly equipped. <laughs> Y'all want to play? What the f- Oh my god. Oh, somebody else has got a little bit of PTSD going on here. Do they even know who he is? Probably not. He's a king of a different country. No, he's K Harold's king of Denmark, Canute's king of England. Okay. Ah, Harold looks like an epic king. Why do I feel like shit's gonna turn and they're gonna go against each other? Or maybe Harold will just die. I don't know. Let's let's see what happens. Oh wait, he's got a sister too. What if I feel like I've heard the name Eshtedi before? Have we seen her before? I don't remember. Oh my god, dude is dying. Jesus Christ. Is Canute going to have to take over Denmark too? Oh, he's waking up. Sheesh. England and Denmark? That's a lot to control. Oh, the smile on his face. He knew exactly what's happening. He planned this. Wait, did he make his brother ill? Surely not. I mean, he made the other two people ill, but they weren't related to him. He did, Canute. My boy, come on. That's effed up. That's too much power. England and Denmark, jeez. The king of all the North Sea. Wow. Was his father king of England and king of Denmark? He probably was, to be fair. So, it can be done. Oh, shit. Is this canoe? What? Bro, are we in the paths? What is this? What's happening? This is fucking crazy. Nah, I don't have what he has. History is going to repeat itself, bro. You're going to get you're going to get your noggin sliced off one day by some crazy Viking. It could be Thorfinn, <laughs> for all I know. God, that's so fucked up. His brother seems like a nice person too. Oh, he thinks he's going to be poisoned too. Crazy life, bro. You're always going to be looking over your shoulder because thinks someone's going to get you. Man's really talking to his dead father's head. Jesus. <laughs> Man's got hacky. Jeez. Makes sense, but will it go as easy as uh, he's thinking it will? Like he says, King Sven. Not dad. Not father. One day he's going to look back on this and have so many regrets. He probably regrets it now, but he's just trying to push through it to be the strongest king. Oh, that's so sweet. I mean, he is doing that. Stronger than you and father. Can you even play? Oh, so that was there. Damn. Th these memories hitting. Right, so another very good episode. Uh, firstly, we want to start off by saying Einar and uh, Thorfinn have cleared their lot. They are on the road to becoming free men at the moment. Um, they are 
there is a very confusing timeline going on right now. So on one hand, uh, Kettle is on the way to speak to, I believe, is it the former king or is it a different king? And I'm just getting really confused. Um, so yeah, it's been like three years minimum since obviously we started as slaves. Ain't on fourth in a probably like early 20s now, like very early 20s, I guesstimate. Um, and yeah, Canute is on the other side now of this story where he's king of England, about to lose his older brother due to his own mishaps, or not mishap, he, he, it was all planned. Um, and on the road to become king of Denmark as well, which is crazy. It's going to be super, super interesting to see how the how Thorfinn and Canute intertwine together as the story progresses. I'm very much looking forward to that. Um, whether he has he goes up against Canute or whether they kind of join together in some way to make Thorfinn's dream come true. No war, no poverty. Not poverty, slavery. Um, that could be a pipe dream, though. So I don't know. I'm very much looking forward to it regardless, and it was a very good episode. So anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.